Hi everybody, we are getting ready for the Microsoft E3 2019 press conference. So what are some things you guys are hoping Microsoft brings to the table? Gears 4 for sure. I know the big surprises this year will be Microsoft and Nintendo. I know Nintendo's got a few secret things I'm looking forward to seeing. What I really want to see you is... You know they have secret things? Yeah, I just don't know what that, those are. Oh, okay. Hence their <laughs> secrets there. <laughs> E3 is about surprises. I, yes, that's why I always like E3. I also like watching the conferences a lot because... Rather than waiting till later to be like, hey guys, here's these trailers that dropped. I, I find it much more exciting to watch and see what they're going to be announcing as it goes through and yeah. stuff. So you're hoping for the Gears information? Gears 4. Uh, Gears Funko? Gears Pop. I, you know what? Yeah. I'm sure that'll be okay. Gears Funko. <laughs> I'm sure that'll be okay. I'll check it out. Remember uh, Gears 4 year. is... That was great. That was the best part of V3 for me. That, was, that yeah. definitely was <laughs> a hey, mouth, reaction. Mouth the game just, what the hell is this? <laughs> you're, like, you're like, oh shit, yeah. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, uh, why well, I say Gears 5? Gears 5, I'm sorry. Uh, Gears 4 was just a great, great way to continue this, the trilogy. And um, you can tell it's like in a post-Uncharted world. They both kind of influenced each other in, in the previous generation. So then we had uh, Gears, 5, Gears 4 be influenced a little bit by Uncharted. A little more story-oriented. Uh, they were walking around, you know, you, during your mission. There was active conversation. It was engaging. It was fun. It was... They didn't take itself too seriously. Um, really, really excited to see what they do for Gears 5. Oh. Oh, oh God. Oh, jeez. Right, What's this for? Gears. It's Bohemian Rhapsody. You've seen that music video, right? <laughs> What? Nothing. <laughs> People are trying to escape out of it. Whoa. What is going on? I think when you have those three mirrors like open on the side of your vanity, yeah, you can, like see yourself. I don't have a vanity. It's probably that. Shane doesn't believe in vanity. That's it. That's it. That's, it. That's all we get. Bound by blood. But I bet the pop. Gears of War, we're gonna get like 30 minutes of gameplay. Waiting for that. From the coalition. That was just some these well chick freaking out. Studio head, Rod Ferguson. Rod. Okay, Rod. Thanks, everyone. Look we're excited shirt. to announce that yeah. Gears 5 is releasing on September 10th. Oh, it's not November. Damn. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> And if you want to play four days early, you can with our Ultimate Edition or membership in the newly announced Xbox Game Pass Ultimate. Well, that's good. Cool. Man, with Gears of War 4, we wanted to earn your trust. Four but days with before Gears the 5, first we patch. We want to push the envelope by doing new things never seen in a Gears game before. And we'll tell you all about it this summer. In July, Join us for our Versus Multiplayer Tech Test, where you'll be one of the first to play our all-new competitive game type, Arcade. Mm. In August, at Gamescom, go hands-on with the all-new Horde mode and see how character abilities can turn the tide on the battlefield. Horde mode in, in August. August September, we return to the biggest Gears campaign ever, where we'll explore more of Kate's harrowing journey and celebrate our launch on September 10th. But what are we talking about today? Today, it's a brand new way to fight the swarm. In Escape, you play as one of three hive busters. You and your squad infiltrate the hive, plant the bomb, and escape with your life. Because we all know the best defense is a good offense. It's everything you love about Gears turned up to 11. Is that a multiplayer mode? Maybe, uh, yeah. It might, it's, it could be like, remember how much we played Horde? I never played yeah. the game, but I loved Horde. Yeah. If there's another mode that I would love, that'd be great. Yep. Burke. Well, Look things are being turned up to 11. Cliffy B. Cliffy B just comes out of the ground. Sure went real <laughs> what is this stuff? Shit went real crazy. Went to 12. Dude, this is like a fucking... Uh, I don't like, a, like a rock show or WWE oh. or something, yeah. 
this camera work. Dude, are they gonna bring in a monster? Oh. This is under the stage. Where, what are we doing? What is going on? What are we doing? This is gameplay, isn't it? Who do they keep down here? Haunted maze. Ooh, what's this? They attacked, and we lost everything. Everything except the need for revenge. This might look like a surrender, but it's not. It's an invasion. Uh, it's, like, it's like Bert Gummer. It's like Matrix. Whoa. Oh. Where are those? Set your bomb. Uh, run. And escape. Dude, that guy's facial hair. Like the Borg. Run. Run. Oh! He didn't listen! Uh. Oh. oh, they're waking up. Oh. There's a gunshot. Dun dun. Oh, they got escape. Dun dun. Dun dun. Dude, this is, listen to that. Oh, it is, okay. Yeah, it is. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Is that like the ch Hey, there's a, a chainsaw. Oh. Oh. Ooh. So, Electro knife. Yeah, abilities is like the new thing. Dude, that's cool. I like that. Yeah. Like a class system. Yeah. That's just what everyone's doing now, so. Dude, this escape mode's kinda like a like yeah, a everyone's like been gears zombies. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. Dude, look at that thing. Dude. Oh my oh, god, look at that. There goes the bomb. It's like the rock. Yeah. You better get moving. Get out of there. It's coming oh. still. Or triple X. <laughs> Close the door behind you. Hurry. So it's like a time push. Like you got to keep moving. Like Otherwise you'll get hit Fortnite and PUBG. So you got to yeah. keep moving from the fog yeah. or else. <laughs> that guy's face. He's okay. so happy he was cutting that guy in half. That looks really fun. I think I'd, yeah. I'd yeah. play that over and over. That looks cool. I hope you enjoyed your taste of escape. An aggressive three-player co-op experience, perfect for your living room couch. Oh, good. But it's not just three-player living room couch is weird. You can build them too and challenge your Maybe friends you with the experiences you create. On your couch. And tonight, join me on saying? Mixer as we challenge these three WWE superstars. What? Hey. Hey. What? <laughs> Xavier Wood, AJ <laughs> Styles, and, and Tyler Breeze. Tyler Breeze. Tyler Breeze. Survive a gameplay deep dive from right here in the hive. Why them? So at home, <laughs> Why not, the Aaron? Days, well, uh, friends can play and the black guy Microsoft is a big gamer, has a YouTube channel so good luck out running the for swarm, gaming and stuff. Okay. We'll see you on the yeah, close Rick oh, was. He said Undertaker earlier. He got really close. I was close. Just for you. I knew AJ was a gamer as well. I didn't know about Tyler Breeze. I'm sure. Yeah, these styles. That, that was cool. Oh, is the Undertaker's here? All the, all the old wrestlers make fun of the new guys because they were like drinking, having sex in their hotel rooms, and all the new guys just play video Woo! games all the time. <laughs> <laughs> so we go see some story. I think we're gonna see them. Yeah, I think we're gonna see them play this mode. Yeah. Dude, it's the Terminator. Terminator. The that's the, that's the fucking Terminator. Fucking Terminator. Isn't Speaking Jeff Gordon WWE. in this Terminator Dark, Dark Fate. Fate? What the fuck? There's all the license Gosh. everywhere. All right. right. Puma Smash. <laughs> well, they got that new movie coming out. With Keanu Reeves. Oh, here you go, yeah. Shane. Oh, oh, I hope we get some story. Oh, oh, that's, 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 give us some story. There's Kate. That's General Rom I from the first game. If this will be the first in like a series of pop games, if this will be the new Lego. The new Lego games. It's on a. 
Oh, yeah, it's oh shit. All the, all the Marvel games are, are bobbleheads. <laughs> yeah, Geno Rom from the first game, Rick. Free kittens. Oh my gosh. Jeez. He's gonna it's shoot a, those kittens. It's no. Or to eat them. Aww. <laughs> no, this it poor guy. A, it's a bum! Aww, that poor guy just wanted a kitty. All those other kittens are dead, too. I don't approve. It's a fake cat. Oh, that's different. It's like a tower this game. This is a mobile game. Yeah, yeah. They, they said it was a mobile game, yeah. I wanted an exact copy of Gears of War, just Funko. Hmm, it reminds me of like... Look at that. His head just fell off. Reminds, yeah, me, of Clash, reminds me of Clash Royale. Watch I mean, the Gears 5 world gameplay premiere at Mixer.com slash Gears of War. <coughs> All right, so that's probably what the wrestlers were doing then, maybe? Probably. Okay, yeah, yeah. It would have been a packed video if they would have had, like, a five-minute campaign. <laughs> you know what I mean? They well, just... I didn't think they were going to go campaign. I thought they were going to go more of, like, gameplay footage to yeah. show they had three of them do that escape thing that they were talking about doing. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. So... I mean, the Gears universe has always just had great multiplayer. Uh, I mean, obviously, when it came to Horde, and then a bunch of games started doing stuff like that. But, like, I just love the story and the world and the characters. So, like, for me, that's what I want to see the most. <clears throat> Rick. Well, sadly, Shane left because the next one I had was the Gears 5. Yeah. It was the Gears 5 game and the Gears Pop game. Um, Which, the, I mean, it was just a cutscene with a lady looking at faces. Or becoming faces, right? Well, yeah, but then we also saw the escape. Yeah, uh, yeah. which it, it focused much more on like kind of a horde mode, but it seemed yeah. more like a mix of like a zombie horde thing from Call of Duty, but then like kind of like PUBG and Fortnite, where you mm -hmm. have like a gas pushing you, and you got to keep moving, like, or else you're gonna be get, yeah. you're gonna die well, in that. It kind of reminded me of Unreal Tournament 2004. Uh, the mission thing. Yeah, the mission thing, where like you're going through the train or whatever, and like you. You have to get to one point, and then once you're done with that, everyone starts respawning from there. And yeah. you're, like, pushing along these objectives. Yeah. Well, the thing with that would depend... I mean, we didn't see gameplay, so maybe we can see gameplay from the wrestlers or something. Um, but the uh, the idea of respawning, or, like, once you're dead, are you dead? And sure. it's much more like, you know, Fortnite or one of those battle royales where, like, if you go down, you can be revived by your buddy. Mm -hmm. But if you die, die, you're dead, you know? And it could play kind of like that. So it's kind of a mix of like a battle royale, but more of a cooperative against AI's, you know, horde mode. So it's like yeah. a mix of like all those, hmm. which I think is interesting, but it's weird to go with three players. That was the thing I thought was a little weird. Yeah. I understand Battletoads doing it because they already had three people. Mm -hmm. But uh, like, you know, uh, what Rash, Pimple, and Zitz. Zitz. But Isn't with this one, like you could have done four and just done a four player split screen on the couch. Because that's one thing they said too, was like, you can play it at home on your couch. They're trying to screw over those guys that like learn to master control with just one hand and they play both things. Mm -hmm. That's what they're doing. <laughs> oh, yeah. that it is. So, we well, can use your feet. Yeah, maybe. Well, yeah, it could be a thing too where them. like, you know, they're talking about the classes. Maybe there are three classes. Mm. Maybe. Uh, maybe there's three types of classes they have, like more tanky, more uh, heal, support. Supporty characters, more tanky characters, and more damagey characters or something. Because they did all have kind of different things, like that lightning knife and mm -hmm. stuff too. And I know Shane was mentioning classes seemed to be more of a thing they were going to be doing. Um, but the game itself is set to come out September of this year. Yep. Um, in July, there'll be an arcade mode where you can play versus. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and then in August, there'll be a horde mode available that people can play. And then it comes out the, the following month. So yeah. that's kind of cool to be able to just kind of get your hands on it, try it out. Maybe we'll try to stream it and stuff. And yeah, see I've got a lot of then. catching up to do for the story mode. I've only beaten the first one's story. I've played Horde mode in the third one. I've had a few games. Like the Halo game looks cool, but I don't know where they are in the storyline and stuff for it all. I might have to go to like YouTube and be like, everything I need to know before Halo yeah, Infinite. Yeah, I know. Yeah. <laughs> five games before I... Yeah. Like everything I need to know. Gears of War 5. So, and then there's a Terminator thing, which we just had Terminator in that Death Garden Death game. Garden. Now yeah. they're going to be in uh, Gears of War, but I love a Terminator. Yeah. I don't, it was like Dark Fate. There was Terminator yeah. in WrestleMania. Yeah. yeah. I don't know if that's like a uh, an expansion or if it's like more cosmetic yeah. stuff or what exactly it is, yeah. but Terminator would be yeah. sweet. I mean, as soon yeah. as the foot came down, I'm like, holy shit, it's a T-800. Yeah. But like yeah. when Keanu Reeves' foot came down, I had no idea until I saw his face, yeah. you know? Yeah. <laughs> well, yeah, like... They were showing that shot, and I was like, "How are they getting away with this?" Yeah, right. right? Like that's exact. Oh, oh. that's how. Uh, okay, yeah. they pay money. All right, so yeah, so looks cool. Comes out September tenth. Uh, we'll probably try to check it out here in the next few months too, with the new, uh, the early release beta kind of things and whatnot. Hmm. So, 
well guys that's the microsoft conference that we're covering if you missed anything here uh we should be having this stuff going on to youtube here before too mm -hmm. long um as well as also editing out some of the uh individual things if you're looking for something specific sure. and subscribe and uh, on the youtube channel keep an eye out for all of our e3 content yes and yeah. thank you for everyone who uh, vlog. thank you to everyone who followed and subscribed today i know there's been some we missed you there's but been, few, been talking yeah. about a lot of stuff so thank you guys stay tuned for all the e3 content the vlog and everything else See you guys later. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.